Hey everyone, so I have another edition in my Jacqueline Wilson videos and also my children's literature videos because I'm going to be talking about the Nonminder. Now, first of all, I just want to take a look at the cover. There's something about this cover which is very old. Now, as you may know, a lot of the Jacqueline Wilson book covers have been revamped. They're still illustrated by Nick Sherratt, but they look slightly more modern. This one you can tell straight away that it is kind of not as modern but the illustrations are still very pretty and this is one of the more colourful Jacqueline Wilson books you know there's there's not a dull bit on there the story itself is really interesting it's about a girl called Sadie and her mother is a childminder but one day her mother is really ill like me just now you can kind of hear I have a cold but her mother is ill she basically has the flu so all the parents of these children that are childminded by which I mean they're one year old and two year old they're not like eight or nine year olds they're, they're quite young the parents are like, well, we're going to have to do something because Sadie's mother has never let us down before, so it's not, we can't moan. And then they start thinking about taking the babies into work, and obviously that's a really bad idea because how many officers and whatever let you work? I mean, one of them is a police officer. How many police officers can go, can be on duty with a baby with them? So there's a lot of questions that they, they have to answer before they decide what they're going to do. And it's all about finding a solution to helping Sadie's mother while she's ill finding a way to look after these babies on different days and Sadie also helps because she is nine years old and it's a school holiday and the reason it's written and I really like this the fact that Jacqueline Wilson actually gives reasons for written is because it is her school diary she's been asked to write a diary for over I think she's got like a week off school she's been asked to write a diary entry as homework so she writes a diary entry every day as you will see the first one is Monday and she writes that and then you know Tuesday, Wednesday, yada yada so I like the fact that she actually has a reason for writing it and she's not just writing it if that makes sense so that is really good as well the the writing size is not too big not too small which I like the illustrations are there they're they're not that frequent they're every say two or three pages some really nice ones so that's really nice it is a really nice story there's a lot going on and you're kind of thinking can they pull through this? This is going to be a big task. How are they going to resolve it? It's not It's not like a massive, oh my goodness, is that what they were going to do? It's just more of, oh, right, that works. You know, it's not like so gripping that you can't put it down at my age, whereas some of her other ones are still like this. But it, it's, it's, it's a nice slow read. It won't take a lot to get through it. I mean, there are just short of, okay, there, there are 91 pages. Um, sorry, I just want to show you this illustration, that's the funniest thing I've ever seen. There are 91 pages, which I think is a nice amount. As I said, the writing isn't big there. As a mature reader, you can get through that in a sitting. Not a problem. Obviously, this is aged, sort of, I'd say, 7 to 10 year olds, depending on reading ability and reading age. But it's definitely one of the, the best younger Jacqueline Wilson books. It's sort of on par with Cat Mummy, which I love, um, Sleepovers, Lizzie's Zip Mouth, that sort of age range. And it is, it, it reads really well, it flows beautifully, and there are some good little little sort of bits along the way. So please feel free to leave comments on this or anything else. Um, a few people have requested that I talk about certain Jacqueline Wilson books. One of the most requested was my sister Jodie. I don't actually have it yet, I will get it as soon as. I don't know why, I've not, I've not heard that many rave reviews about it to be honest, but we'll see. Uh, yeah, but that's it for just now, so I'll see you all next time. Bye!